Welcome to the operational video for your new Glion Balto electric scooter. First thing I'm going to do is go through the controls on the handlebars. We have our power button. A single press turns on your LED lights showing you your battery charge. A press and hold for two seconds shows you turning off the battery. And then a single press while the Balto is on turns your lights on and turns your lights off. Below the power indicator is your throttle for forward. On the left side, we have a switch that has F, S, fast, and slow. We recommend that all users begin on the slow setting. We also have our handbrake. And below the fast and the slow, we have a left turn indicator and a right turn indicator. And below that, we have a horn. Now we're going to go over some basic operations of the Glion Balto electric scooter. First thing to know is whether you sit down or stand up, the Glion Balto can actually be run either way, whether you prefer to stand or sit. What we recommend doing is when you learn how to ride the Balto, is finding an open space like an empty parking lot where you'll be free of pedestrians and traffic and have less likely to run into something accidentally. Take your kickstand up and then in slow mode we recommend you gradually put pressure with your right hand on the throttle so you start to understand how far it will go on throttling and then you can start learning braking. So you move forward and then brake and then forward and then brake. I'm going to go back around. Once you understand the basics of throttling and braking and understanding the braking distance, you can start going further and further and faster and faster and gradually building in turns. This has been the Balto from Glion. Now I'm going to show you the folding up and the vertical self-standing location for your Glion Balto electric school. First, we're going to remove the seat, making sure to keep the posts together. Then we are going to remove the rack, which is also the self-standing. making sure to insert the rubber plug into the seat tube. Now we are going to fold down by releasing the stopper and rotating it down. Next, make sure the folding hook latches in place. Now to unhook the latch, release and it slides right out. Now we will use our luggage slash vertical self stand. Make sure that the hooks are up. When placing the Glion Balto electric scooter into the loading rack, make sure the battery is towards the wheels that are on this side. So we have the wheels here, the wheel, lights, and battery all on this side. Then lock it in place. Next, you're going to put the seat in the storage location. And now you are ready to store and wheel around your Glion Balto electric scooter. Now we're going to set back up your Glion Balto electric scooter. First we're going to remove the seat, then undo the latches.
that hold it into the place. Then we lift it out. We release the hook latch, rotate it up, snaps into place, lock the safety latch, lower the kickstand, remove the safety tube holder, release the latch, place the seat back in, latch it in place. Finally, we take our luggage rack and place it back in space, lock it down, and you're ready to ride. This concludes our operating video on the Glion Balto electric scooter. Thank you for purchasing one of our scooters.